Hello there and welcome back to my channel. We have another craft beer review for you today. And today's beer of choice for, as I've casually dubbed it, Minutes of Sours, is a beer from Gamma Brewery. Gamma Brewing, should I say. And they are based in Denmark. And it is a can of their metastatic grid nectarine sour. And it's coming in at 5% ABV. Canon is very nice, probably agree with me. So Gamma, they're based in Denmark, and uh, that's all I can really say about them, because I don't really know the brewery that well myself. Um, I believe I've only ever had one beer from them, and it was their Spin Double IPA. So when I saw this, I thought, that looks about as thick as their Double IPAs and IPAs, but it's a sour. So uh, yeah, without further ado, let's Get it out and into a glass and see see what we have. Look at that. It's glowing. The light coming through it. It's glowing. Beautiful. So we have a lovely kind of very light orange to sort of yellow, hazy, hazy thick looking sour beer with a one, one to two finger white head and it seems to be sticking around which is nice. nice. Um, most of the time when you see a sour it sort of just goes off and it's just kind of the characteristic of the style but it's not always nice to see when one sticks around. Let's get Let's some nose nodes. So I can't really pick up an awful lot, I can just get that general sour smell. It's hard to describe the sour smell. Sort of like slightly wet cardboard. Yeah, there's some very subtle hints of um, nectarine kind of coming through. And just like a really sour, either. obviously a really sour nectarine. <laughs> Not a really lot, ne nectarine, a bit of zinginess, a bit of sourness. Cheers guys, let's, uh, let's give it a taste, down the hatch. Oh. Nice. 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 Oh, that is gorgeous. Excellent beer. Absolutely amazing. It's not too sour actually, it's just about right. It's fairly full bodied, which I think if you were to give it a super duper sourness, would probably be a bit much. It's not over the top sour, but it's, not, it's got just enough there, um, which really goes quite well with the body of the beer. It's um, kind of just like a, like a fresh pineapple juice type thing. You know when you get that kind of sort of, that sort of like zing around your lips when you've had like some fresh juice. It's very much like that. Lovely and dry, well, I say lovely and dry, it's got a dryness to it, which then gets sort of like taken over by just pure fruit juice. It's amazing. And I'll just see if there's any like barley oats. Nectarine puree. Yeah, I mean, it's just, the nectarine puree is giving you that lovely nectarine flavor. Obviously, it's a nectarine sour, um, and then you've got the oats, which is why you're getting the such a thick-looking hazy beer. It's beautiful. It sort of just yeah, it reminds just it just reminds me of biting into a fresh nectarine, and then it, it's just super refreshing. Um, excellent, excellent beer for sipping back on a hot day. Pure nectarine up front, thick mouth feel. Absolutely solid beer, it's been put together extremely well. That's easily one of the best sours I've had for a long time. And uh, 
if you can get it, get it. Don't don't hesitate, just get it. <laughs> yeah, now I'm gonna give that, that's a solid nine out of 10. So nine out of 10 for me, thank you very much. I've been me and you've been you. Cheers and I'll see you next time. Uh.